So Mr. Hensley Armbrister, we're here in November. You had surgery in January of this year. Um, you had a spine fusion. Yes. So tell me how you felt before your um, surgery of your lumbar spine. Yes, before I had the surgery in January of this year, 2015, I had an accident at work mm -hmm. where I slipped down a flight of stairs which resulted in my back problems and shoulder issues. And I suffered, and I suffered for 14 months. Mm -hmm. Out of that 14 months, I underwent physiotherapy for approximately eight months. Mm -hmm. That discontinued, I had an epidural shot. Mm -hmm. I was on a number of pain meds, uh, to no avail, nothing had any effect on me. I guess because my pain tolerance was so high mm -hmm. that those things had no effect on me. I got some information concerning a doctor in the United States, Dr. Gregory Busevonic. Mm -hmm. And this was in November of 2014 mm -hmm. when I came to the United States. I met with Dr. Busevonic and his fine team, and we went through the motion. He interviewed me extensively. I outlined what I've been experiencing, and he's a firm believer that surgery is, I believe, that should not just rush into surgery. Right. At one point I got the impression he was trying to talk me from doing a surgery. Mm -hmm. But um, what I now know today of him and his fine team, I returned to the Bahamas that same month of November and in January I returned to have surgery. Mm -hmm. And uh, I was still experiencing my back problems. Mm -hmm. After correction before the surgery he said to me if you go into surgery I am expecting you to get up within a day or two mm -hmm. and so he helped me to that I went in and I had surgery mm -hmm. he corrected my problem mm -hmm. and I felt as if I'd been reborn mm -hmm. I didn't have the pains that I was experiencing and uh, with his guidance and his team at the office, I listened intently, and I've been able to do some things to help myself. Mm -hmm. I've been back in forth the United States uh, for this year alone, somewhere about eight times or so, for my follow visit. Okay. And yes, I've had some little minor little pains here and there, but nothing compared to what it used to be. Mm -hmm. I would encourage anyone who listen to this interview or see this interview to consider coming to Miami Back and Neck and see Dr. Busevonic and his mm -hmm. fine team here. Mm -hmm. Whatever your issues are, they would correct it. Mm -hmm. I think that I'm a testament that I have returned to active duty as a police officer back home in the Bahamas. And I sometimes work a normal 12 hour tour of duty and coupled with continued exercises right. and proper eating, rest, and doing the things that you know is right, mm -hmm. you will be on a road to full recovery mm -hmm. like I am. And I say that with all honesty and sincerity. Mm -hmm. This is the place to come. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Mm -hmm. Thank you.